All right, I found the last barrel. I think we should be good. Um, forgot what I was gonna say. I was gonna bring. Oh yeah, okay. I, I have a. I have something to bring up. So, as much as I'm complaining right now, it's uh, it's just because I care about the game. I love this game. It's a game from my childhood that I used to play all the time. It's basically the WoW alternative, in my opinion, uh, the World of Warcraft alternative. So. I do love this game, and I do love that the developers are bringing it back, and they're putting a lot of time, a lot of heart and soul into it. I Did I complete both of these? Okay, I did. It's very misleading. So, I'm very, I'm, like I said, I'm very happy that, you know, they're bringing it back, they're doing a great job, and I said that earlier as well, but the only reason I'm complaining is because I, I do want to see some progress, and there's a lot of progress that we need to see, in terms of performance and all that other shit and also because it's getting on my nerves <laughs> there's only so much i can take all right great job thanks dude so i guess we're delivering the glass ring to june glass ring what the hell we went through all that trouble to get glass and tin i guess that explains the shipments of sand but does it have to be like absolute like clean sand we couldn't just go to the beach and Get a bucket and then just scoop some up. I guess it actually had to be legit clean sand. I guess uh, the Minecraft logic really doesn't play in here. But that's fine. Let's go deliver a glass ring to June. But yeah, I am complaining, guys. But I don't mean anything in a harmless way. Or harmless. Harmful way. Uh, you know, just... I want to see some progress made. These issues are real. And they're irritating. And for me to play on my own... I can't have these issues going on, man. Like, I can't be crashing every 10 minutes just because of a memory leak, just because I'm playing music in the background or I have the music on in this game. I mean, that's that's a problem. I don't remember Toontown Rewritten having these same issues. I really don't. But then you gotta remember, this ain't Toontown Rewritten. It's its own thing with a completely different staff. A perfect replica. Beautiful, eh? Now, next on me list, I had a nice flock of chickens, lovely little things that were like me pets. Gordon stole them as well. Replace me flock so I can get the eggs to my beloved Peter. You got it. So, cover five chickens from Port Royal Crates. People were saying that this quest was actually bugged, and they could not find chickens. Let's see what we can find, if we can at all. I'm optimistic, I think we'll be able to find something. I was able to do this successfully when I did these quests on my main. I don't know how far I got with my main, so keep in mind what I said earlier. Uh, I, there is going to be a point where I'm going to be playing this shit blind. That's not a crate. Why did I even consider that? Uh, we're going to have to just run around and see if we can search like that. Nope, nothing interesting there. Alright, I really hope this quest isn't bugged because if it is... We're done playing. Like, I'm not even joking. There's nothing else I can do. There's, I could do all the side quests, but I'm pretty sure you guys wouldn't want to see that. I would. Just, I just want to continue on. But I can't if the game is having some sort of issue. Why are there only barrels, man? And why are there crates stacked on top of each other? I, I won't be able to search those. That's That's just logic. You can't search a crate if it's on top of another crate. How about this one? There we go, we can search that, but do we get a chicken out of it? Do we? We do, alright. Maybe there wasn't even a bug, maybe people were just getting like completely unlucky and they just could not search any crate. Just said nothing interesting here. Another question is why the fuck are there chickens in the crates? I do not understand that. <coughs> Sorry for the coughing, I'm uh... Experiencing some uh... Why am I still searching? Okay. I'm experiencing some uh, talking issues, I guess you could say. I was recording another uh, playthrough, and I noticed that it was getting harder and harder to talk. If it at all gets a little bit harder to talk here, I may have to end the session a little early because uh, I don't have any water or anything with me right now. So if I start to have some issues with my throat and or talking or whatever, I'm pretty much done like, there's nothing I can do. I can cough all I want, but I'll just sound like I'm dying. Sorry, guys, I'm just... 
This, is the, this has got to be like the worst recording session yet. Why is it not marking on my map where I'm supposed to go? I try really hard with these episodes out of any other episodes or videos that I record on my channel right now. Like this is the top playthrough that I'm focusing on. Because a lot of people actually watch it. A lot of new people to the channel, which is fantastic. I love that. And I want to be able to uh, maintain this new audience. So I'm trying my hardest. It's just, this has got to be the worst one. This has got to be the worst session. All right, June. Aren't they lovely? Yeah. The chickens, I mean, so noble and handsome. Reminds me of Peter. Wow. When I look at a chicken, it also makes me think of my significant other. Please gather some more chickens for my beloved... He loves eggs. Recover six chickens from Navy ships. Can it, it can be any Navy ship. All right. We're 62% done with June Stolen Items Part 1. I mean, there's a Part 2. 22% done with the Gordon Greer quests. So, if you don't know, like, 22%, round that to 20, we're about a fifth done. That's not bad, actually, since that's all we've been focusing on uh, this, or for the most part, with this session. I think maybe it'll take us two, three sessions to actually do this. Then again, it depends how long these sessions are. So, I guess let's uh, go set sail wherever I actually go here, because I can't jump here. I really wish I could, but I, 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 I honestly can't. I really wish I could just, like... Can I, can I go over here and fall? Oh, yes, I can. All right. So, something I did not mention in the beginning of this session, I have another ship. I have the Laughing Dog. Alright, here we are. So this is a uh, much bigger ship from what I originally had. I wanted to wait until I was level 5 to get something worth my money, but eh, whatever. I needed something that was a little bit strong. Because it seems as if the ship AI has improved. It seems as if, if I fire at this Navy Ferret, it will fire back. It's still a little glitchy. It, it, it is. And I don't even know if I want to try going for this Navy Ferret because it's kind of far away and I don't know if this will hit. Will it? Oh, wow, it did. Holy shit, that did damage. Yeah, it seems as if um, the, uh, the firing is a little bit better as well with the broadside cannons. Um, I missed all those shots. Let's try that again. Hell yeah, so I'm, well, kind of, I'm really happy that things are somewhat working here. I, I'm, I'm attacking the sails, that's not what I want to do. I'm attacking the water, that's also not what I want to do. There we go. Yeah, I'm really happy that the sailing is working a lot better. It, it's going to make this just a little bit more enjoyable. The sailing system's still kind of meh, in my opinion. But, you know what? They're, they're trying. I'll give them that. So, uh, I'm gonna get away from this guy. I'll go find some navy ships. I'll sink them. I'll also try to get away from this island because it just makes it a little bit harder to get near ships. And, uh, you guys can do whatever the hell you want. Alright, that's two out of six. That ship was firing at me. Which for some reason wasn't doing all that much in terms of damage. That's fine. I guess, uh, as, as, the, the, the thing is, is that the ships are actually firing back. They don't initiate the battle, which I thought they did back in the original game. They don't initiate the battle, so if you get close to, like, a big dangerous ship, they won't start firing at you, I'm pretty sure. But if you fire at them, they will fire back. That I can confirm. Holy fuck, we can do a lot. You know what? Hold up. I'm actually going to kill this guy... With the use of my right broadside cannons. Not sure why the right, but whatever. Fuck yeah, dude. That was that was hot, dude. That actually really turned me on. Fantastic. So we're halfway done. This is going to be too easy. Like, finally. The sailing just works. It's going to be too easy. I'm going to go destroy this Navy Greyhound. All right, that's four out of six. All right, that's five out of six. We're almost done, guys. I should uh, dedicate to the. I should really dedicate this video to counting. 
as I'm doing a lot of it. We're going to go for this Navy Vanguard. This is going to be my toughest foe yet in the session, of course. But now that sailing is working, I mean, let's let's see if this guy's tough. Okay, that guy was not tough. I'll be honest. So we do have some treasure, but I don't think it's anything good. So we'll just teleport back to Port Royal. We'll turn in this quest. All will be good. We found some chickens from ships. After finding chickens from crates. I think the ship... I think having, like, chickens on ships makes a little bit more sense. The fact that we're destroying, like, navy ships for chickens is a little weird. When you think of things, like, in perspective, it's a little weird. 